this. I am. <laughs> okay, go for it. All right, so I won't. Uh, what? In your definition, what is too young? Uh, infantile? Oh yeah, that's definitely too young. <laughs> but... <laughs> so what he does is he likes to uh, yell at people using biblical terminology, call them that they're heathens and they're going to go to hell because they're gay or lesbian. Or they look at porn. How do I... Ooh, is this, is this good? On, is this on me pretty well? Yeah, yeah, it's on. Am I fully... Formed? Yeah, you're in the center. For real? Yeah. Wow. That is not bad for one shot. Let's see. So now I'm just going to uh, camera mode, video. And they've been enclosing on that, guys. Since they were about here at noon. They've been closed since then. Nice. Good people. All right. Yeah. Can we, uh, can I get one more double confirmation that we're good? Yeah, you're in the center. So, so it's kind of at an off angle. Ooh. How's this? I can't see. Ooh. I'll move this. Yeah, you're in the center and you're, look, and you're looking straight. And because, if I'm talking to you like this, it's pretty the good. The angle had it look had it looking like you're literally anything like this. you want. All right, man, you've been awesome. You've been a great help. All right, so the there's not really much. Ooh, ooh, ooh. You might want to level even, the table. We are not on even ground here. Let's try some. I brought a book with me just in case. That might be too big. I mean, I don't think it matters. It's a lot better than it was before. Yeah, it was. Hopefully you aren't recording this yet, because it's going to be uh, pretty uh, jinky. That's funny. Okay. Austin. So you're a YouTuber? Uh, I don't like to... You, you don't like it, but you do post to YouTube. I do post to YouTube. It's for accessible for everybody. Ah. And um, so we're recording right now. Okay. The thing about this is, I believe in people being able to have a conversation with each other, short chat, in a like really friendly term, literally about anything. There's a guy behind us who's like screaming a bunch of stuff right now. Yeah. I guess I want to talk about really anything that you believe is really true, anything that you find deeply motivating. I don't necessarily share the same views with the guy back there, and I'm not going to try to get you in any kind of yeah. church. That's not what I'm about at all. I'm really just trying to find out like... The things that you believe in, have you used a reasonable way or the rational way to get to that conclusion? Is there anything that you're absolutely sure about? Oh, by the, oh, by the way, I'm Ty. You introduced yeah. yourself to me a long time yeah, ago. Yeah, Austin, yeah. I'm Ty. It's nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, too. Uh, well, there's nothing really on my mind. Is there anything that you know you can't be wrong about? Uh, the Second Amendment. Second Amendment, which is? Tell me out. I'm a bad American. Right to bear arms yes. as part of a regulated militia? That's uh, one part where uh, I think everyone gets confused now. Okay, how about that then? Second Amendment is something that you think no, that you are absolutely right about? I wouldn't say absolutely, but uh, I know I'm right on a few aspects of it. Mm. I don't understand the claim. What is it about the Second Amendment that you find absolutely true? That uh, uh, American citizens have the right to uh, keep and own firearms. Is there any exceptions with that whatsoever? Uh, as far as the amendment goes, without any uh, other laws in place, yes. But there have been laws in place to uh, keep people that are mentally uh, ill mm -hmm. from uh, getting firearms, but so far that doesn't seem to have worked. Okay, okay. Um, so your claim, would you say then that your idea is that everyone has a right to own firearms regardless of their mental condition, regardless of their age? That's the one part where I disagree on that. Uh -huh. on, on a, no, well, I disagree with my... With, with that standing is that like people like the uh, Las Vegas shooter oh and by the way yeah like I said yeah. five minutes I'm not here to waste your time oh, yeah. and if you want to talk longer I'm totally cool with that too All right. so people like the Las Vegas shooter uh, where he was uh, confirmed to have some sort of mental illness or Adam Lanza from Sandy Hook uh -huh. so I think that people that uh, uh, have a sane sense of thought mm -hmm. and uh are not mentally ill mm -hmm. should have the right to keep and bear arms because there are always people that break the law, go to the black market, and get firearms, and next thing you know, they're breaking down your door. Okay, totally understand. Especially if you live in like a rural area where there's like yes. wilderness, and also in prime areas such as Chicago. Your water, sir. Ooh, thanks so much. Like in Chicago, it has the most gun laws, but yet it has the highest gun crime rate. Like mm. not too long ago, there was what twenty something people killed in mm. one weekend, mm. sixty others wounded, mm. but yet they have the highest gun laws. But you wouldn't say people who are mentally ill or people who are too young should have guns. You're not putting. To, are you putting it to that extreme? Uh, I'm. I'm not going to say. Ooh, my bad. 
and that's going to happen a bunch. Ooh, let me fix that for you. All right. Uh, you're angled down there. Yeah, I sure am. You're going to have fun editing this. I am. <laughs> okay, go for it. All right, so I want, uh, what, in your definition, what is too young? Uh, infantile? Oh, yeah, that's definitely too young. But, <laughs> <laughs> but well, I think that people are scared of what they don't understand. Oh, it's mm. starting to rain. Uh, and, uh... So, if uh, parents uh, inter introduce firearms to the kids, say maybe four or five years old, when they get an understanding, they can start uh, they can start understanding people. Yeah, they can uh, start learning more about firearms, how to be safe around them, and not uh, just be scared around them. Mm, true, because uh, firearms make the big loud bang. But if you start them off maybe on a BB gun right. and work out from there, people won't be as scared of. Or develop the discipline to wield one properly. Yes, and there's always the number one rule of firearms. Finger off the trigger. Mm. If people will learn that, uh, the people who are uh, no firearms and uh, know how to handle them safely know uh, when to and when to not use it. Is there a possibility that the Second Amendment, as it is right now, could benefit from some additional clarity that you're providing me right now? Like, if we were able to amend it, not yeah. to change it entirely, yeah. but just to add some, some clarity, nuance to yes. it? But uh, there are groups out there that do wish to see the uh, abolishment of the Second Amendment. Okay, and that, I feel, is a little bit too extreme on the other side. But as far as the Second Amendment being something that you absolutely have your faith in, is it more of the principle because it seems like you're willing to modify it to make it more clear. Yeah, make it more clear that every citizen, uh, regardless of a of race, gender, or uh, creed, mm -hmm. can have it. But with that slight added uh, part of uh, making sure that you are still well enough in the head to uh, own enough. a firearm and not go on a rampage. Okay, yeah, and old enough to yeah. possibly yeah. those kinds of stipulations. Like uh, not too long ago, after uh, the Parkland shooting, they put laws into effect that you cannot buy uh, an AR-15 or something after the age of 21. Okay, pretty cool. I'm fine with that as far. So it sounded, just as a quick summary, Yeah. Uh, it sounded like you really strongly believed in the Second Amendment to the point where you knew you couldn't be wrong, but you are open for it to be I'm open for clarified discussion. and changed yes. a little bit. There are other sides that say we should get rid of it. I don't think that is a solution to criticism. But what I think is, I like that you're open to the fact that if the Second Amendment was able to be more clear and we're ready to change it, I'd be more open to like yeah. presenting that as other people for rules to follow. Yeah. I like that. Thank you very much, Austin. Thank you. you. Mind if we did one other random kind of talk? Or yeah. are you busy right now? No. Uh, I don't have to be anywhere until 4 I think it's going to rain. For yeah, so let's go. Let, I'll, yeah. I'll, I'll, I'll let's hand up underneath there. Thank you, man. Yeah.